Hello, this is Helson. Welcome back to my play by email version, Jokub Heinen. Today we're going to be going over our orders and strategy for December 12th, 1941. Alright, so starting off over here, uh, we're loading up the clods here to take them to the truck. A couple of turns, well, again, we'll be able to upgrade those. Uh, we're starting to see subs moving to the area, so we're concentrating on ASW. Uh, 144th Regiment should be getting in this turn. We'll unload, redo, and then get them set up with a couple battleships that are already there. Or Ambon, um, our invasion force should be landing at Sedate this turn. Fast transport, the other transports are probably about two turns out for, I believe, Sarong and Manado. Uh, our bombardment failed to Santa Can. Either he, uh, nothing there, or we missed. Probably, I don't know. I still think there was something there. So, Unfortunately, they decided to go up and around the Philippines instead of around here because I'd have direct on. So we're going to head down south. We might bomb, bombard Kagayan on the way through this through. The other two Barbara battleships should be getting in there. So we might be able to do a forward bot uh, bombardment of Ambon. That might be worth it. Uh, meanwhile, we did uh, take out Lingayan. We'll probably hold here until we get some reinforcements. We only got about 600 AB here. I do not want to be running into uh, a whole bunch. Don't want them to get uh, destroyed. Moving some more subs out. Keeping everything around here to cut down anything coming to the south, I think. Uh, we should arrive in Mersing this turn. We're going to keep up our bombardment on the airfields here. Um, Imperial Guard Division should reach Sangura this turn. Unpack. Should definitely get unpacked before they get in anywhere like that. Um, we'll continue attacking this guy. Uh, we got two more turns until the truce is up in Rangoon. We're going to go ahead and move out the 22nd Air Flotilla. We'll start them marching, get them up into Bangkok so we can get some torpedoes up there. Um, we're starting to get our forces in Chiang Mai, and these guys will start building up the airfields here. Um, our forces for the invasion of Palembang are starting to get into the area, unpacking. So we have uh, forces heading south for Sinkaran and Kuching that are uh, loading up. Uh, da -da -da. Move the rest of our forces out of Sama. Um, should have an attack going in Hong Kong this turn. So this Eighth Army HQ should arrive in Hong Kong this turn for the attack to help. Uh, we're still moving around. Forces up here. We're still trying to catch as many of these guys in open terrain as possible. Slow them down. Um, doo -doo -doo. We're starting to buy out a couple of the armored units to get them sending out. I think we bought out one this turn. And then we were one point short of getting the second uh, large tank unit out. So we'll buy them out this turn and send them on their way. Uh... We're loading up the 21st Division in Shanghai. We're loading up the 2nd Division in Tokyo with the 33rd and 4th Division two days out from being able to load up. Um, I am still torn on whether or not we're going to land them in the Philippines and try to brute force our way through uh, Parkfield. Or do we take those four divisions and head straight for Java along with Palembang? And we take out Java, we take out Sumatra earlier, and then we can fin start filling in the back way and take out the Philippines afterwards, or head to Burma. I'm kind of leaning towards Java right now. I don't know. I'm still debating. I don't think he's been up, but been able, he hasn't been able to build up many forts here, but he's going to have probably anywhere from 1,200 to 1,600 AV and times three terrain. Now, it's mostly Filipino troops. Uh... We're getting filled, what, six divisions, say on average 350, so 700, about 2100. We, three times the train, I just don't think we can fill enough combat power to be the brute force my way through there. I think we just keep the airfield him from building forts, and then we come on with uh, follow on forces as they become available. That's sort of where I'm leaning with towards now, but we'll see. Um, we will land at least in one other division, so maybe I'll land like the 21st division and go ahead and get them filled up so we can actually start bombarding and burning some supply through here. We'll have to see. Uh, let's see, about two turns, I think Kaga will be able to arrive in Takao in about one, two, three, three or four turns before Taiyo and Ryujo get there. And then we'll resize, upgrade to zero, let's get those guys ready for covering Palembang. And then maybe Java in that if we decide to go that way. Um, 
Remember there, we might go ahead and break off some of the battleships and do a bombardment on one child. If he wants to leave fighters there, we can do a lot of damage to keep him from building force with that, and then they can rearm in Shanghai. Uh, meanwhile, we're trying to catch this guy. Again, like I said, as much damage as we can. We'll probably move out the 22nd Division just to tie these forces down. And then our main push is going to start coming along through here and to get into this clear terrain and kind of push as much as we can here. But that's pretty much where we're at right now. Um, let's see, point-wise, we're looking at... We've lost three ships for 26 points. We've just sank 79 for 462. Now, this is probably low on the low end. Army points tend to be pretty accurate. So 251 to 2 and 105 to 42. This is fairly accurate. It's always ships, especially on our end, because we have terrible uh, intelligence. But we've done pretty good. Uh, we've lost only, what, one, two, 20 pilots so far. That's not too, too bad, honestly. Uh, we are trying to ramp up the building of Oscars. We need so many to replace these nates. But it's going to take us a while until we build up the, uh, our Oscars. So we're running low on actually quality army fighters. We got uh, maybe we can upgrade a squad to Oscar one Bs, but that's not. I mean, it's better than names, but it's not saying much, right? Um, we got a lot of zeros, but most of those are going to take up in the refitting of the mini Kadut Batai. And then also, I would like to once we get Kitty Batai or to truck, I'd like to resize maybe um, a land unit and then carry more fighters on the Kitty Batai. Well, I have to think about that. The problem is I don't have the f train personnel for it. So, uh, so I can't expand too, too fast because if I expand too fast, then we just don't have the training unit. So that's what our plan is for right now. We're just moving everything around, get our logistics set up. Next turn, it'll probably be a big turn on logistics. We'll start getting uh, Shanghai, our Port Harbor, or Port Arthur, Ijo, Fusan, uh, expand Sapporo, Tohara, and start expanding these guys, start to get resources flowing in. Got some oil already loading up. We need to get some patrol boats for this guy. Uh, we do know we have two Dutch subs here. We know we got two Dutch subs here. And then we saw one Dutch sub here. And then we saw the Americans moving in from Hawaii. We're probably, they're probably heading for truck, not here, but yeah. So that's where we're at right now guys so we should get the combat turned uh, probably today so we'll probably have that video out tomorrow